Good morning, Foley High School. Will you please stand for a moment of silent meditation and remain standing as we honor our nation in reciting the Pledge of Allegiance. And now, join me for the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America, and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Good morning, Foley High School. I'm Caitlin Ebert. And I'm Shelby Hoffman. Well, the end of the week is finally here, so Shelby, do you have any plans for this weekend? Actually, not for this weekend, but I am getting pretty excited for winter ball taking place next week. Oh yeah, that is next weekend. Yeah, let's just hope Dawson remembers to buy our tickets. Oh yeah, and if you haven't bought your ticket, make sure to stop by Miss Larwig's room to buy yours today. But we still have some other announcements from around campus, so listen up because this is the Lion Pride News. trip but wondering what all it includes well it includes full-time tour director completely bilingual European breakfast and dinner daily and then we also have round trip plane fare and it's a great deal guys if you're interested in signing up for this trip please attend the meeting on February 10th at 6 o'clock in the Foley library with Mr. Reed sophomore class of 2017 shirts are now available for pre-order $12 for short sleeve $15 for long sleeve these awesome shirts are fully blue with gold lettering and can be worn until you graduate Bring a check or cash and order your shirt in room 300 with Ms. Frazier or room 921 with Ms. Dossett by Wednesday, February 4th. Anyone interested in being part of next year's dance team, the Blue Diamonds, a member of Color Guard, or even a new member of the band, please stop by and see Mr. Major in the band room. Happy birthday to Ms. Amanda Major, Mickey Skipper, and Blair Cook. I hope you all have a great day. Hi, I'm here with Owen, who's our new foreign exchange student. So, Owen, where are you from? Uh, hi, I'm from the Netherlands. And, um, where in the Netherlands are you from? I'm from uh, a city, it's in the Nijmegen, it's in the east of the Netherlands, really close to Germany, only about like 20 minutes away. And so, you live in a city, right? So, how is it coming from a big city like that to the country now? Yeah, you know, it's different, but it's interesting to see, and overall, it's, you have more like hospitality here, and people are just warmer and open overall, so I really enjoy it here. Awesome. And um, I gotta ask you this question, Owen. What is your favorite American food? My favorite American food? Um, I think ribs. Mm. Baby back? Yeah, of course. Yum. Um, last question. What is your favorite memory so far in the United States? Um... Um, I think meeting my host family, it was really a great experience, and they were so nice and open and so welcoming, and it was like one of the best things I've experienced so far. And your host family, don't, don't one of their um, their sons go to the school? Isn't that Colton Lord, right? Yes, that's correct. That's correct. And how is it with him since he's, you know, the pun of the day, is he, is it a not, is he like a good brother or a bad brother? Of course, he's a good brother. He's a really great kid, yeah. That's great. Well, thank you so much, Owen. And now back to the news. The Lighthouse Youth Task Force will meet Thursday, January 29th in the library immediately after school. When is Scholars Bowl practice? Eh, Monday after school in Mr. Reed's room. What do you not need to forget? Eh, your complete permission slip for Thursday's meet. The Foley Fireworks will be performing their halftime routine at tonight's basketball game against McGill. Please come out to cheer on the fireworks and our Foley Lions. Seniors, the Financial Aid Office for Faulkner State Community College has scheduled a FAFSA night at Foley High School for you and your parents or guardians on Thursday, February 19th from 6 to 8 p.m. Space is limited, so please sign up with Ms. Daniels today. The sign-up deadline is Friday, February 13th. Seniors, if you're going to the senior class trip, make sure to pay your $100 deposit by January 31st. Also, seniors, Balfour Invitation slash wearables are here. Please see Mrs. K in room 207 to pick up your stuff. You can come by here before and after school or during all lunch waves. Please don't interrupt classes. 
Hi, I'm Mike Battaglia. Hi, I'm Ashley Patterson. And this is your M&A Movie Reviews. So this weekend I had the fortune of going to see Wedding Ringer, which I talked about last week. And it was incredibly hilarious, just like I was hoping it would be, and it was also kind of emotional. Um, I learned that Doug Harris, the main guy, also played in Disney's Frozen as Olaf the Happy Snowman. I've been in And I learned from the movie that bromance always trumps romance. Mm -hmm. And didn't you get to see American Sniper this weekend? I did. It was amazing. It was an action-packed, tear-jerking movie. And it was directed by Clint Eastwood, who's made very, very amazing and action-packed movies. And another kind of nugget in there <laughs> is it had Bradley Cooper from The Hangover in it. Love and that movie. I heard that you, uh, you saw Selma. How was that? The reviews on that were incredible, weren't they? Yeah, I didn't myself go see Selma, but I saw many reviews. It has a 99% rating on Rotten Tomatoes. Wow. Which, if you don't know Rotten Tomatoes, that's really incredible. Mm -hmm. um, one of the reviews said, like Dr. King did, the film captures your mind and your heart as it entertains the way great movies often do. It was awesome. So it accurately depicts a huge cultural mov movement in America. It's a great movie. I encourage everyone to go see it. I'm going to go see it this weekend. And that's all I have about that. That's awesome. Well, that's all your entertainment news for today. Have a great day. Hi, I'm Kelly Brown, and this is your sports segment. Tonight, our Lions and Lady Lions will host a huge area conference game against the McGill Yellow Jackets here in our home court. JV boys tip off at 4.30, followed by Varsity girls at 6 o'clock, with the Varsity boys taking the court at 7.30. We want a full house tonight. Come show your support. Also, all archery team members, this Saturday, your tournament will be held in Saraland. The cost to go is $12. You will also need lunch money. Bus is leaving at 8.45 a.m. on Saturday morning. You will be back around 2 o'clock p.m. Also, team members, if you have any other questions, see your coach. That's all of your sports updates for today. Now back to the news. Today for lunch we're having chili chicken crispitos, black beans, baby carrots, mixed fruit, and salsa and sour cream, and milk. Eat your vegetables. I wrote a novel about this guy who had a small garden. It didn't have much of a plot, though. And that's all of your news for today. Join us again for more news from around campus. Have a great day, everyone.